Hi there, it's Diggin. Welcome to DTV. I'm Diggin, as I said, and this is the vibe. DTV for short. I am going to, uh, this evening, I'm going to address a question that I've heard many a people ask and well at least 15 years 18 years I can honestly say I've heard this question again 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 and I've answered um, this question only to uh, a few people a handful of people because during this time people were only embracing metaphysics only then and so the last past decade it's been a lot easier for me to relay messages um, um, things I've seen um, prophecies they've given me and questions and when I say they I'm talking about angels I'm talking about guides I'm talking about Jesus and I'm talking about God. So the one question that seems to be asked quite a bit is why are all pictures or statuettes or drawings or carvings, why are angels always depicted with wings? Or people, um, even, eh, I don't want to say saints, not exactly. I'm, I'm going to stick with, with angels because um, it does mean um, uh, from heaven thou came. It's as simple as that. So what's this thing with the wings? Okay, well, I'm going to tell you. I don't know in what heaven... I saw them come from so I don't know what sphere it was and I saw a conglomeration and this conglomeration um, was was in the sky and in the sky and um, at a later video I will expand on this but for now I want to answer the question um, uh, in the sky what I had seen was a battle I had seen a war and when I was looking and I was in complete awe I mean I was in awe uh, the wings came out of um, a suit that they were wearing and the suit abled um, uh, them um, uh, uh, when they left a ship or a pod or, well, I can't say, you, you know, that I saw them leaving either or because I just heard, you know, crackling up in the heavens and I looked up and I saw angels coming in to our skies and uh, they were battling and who they and, and there was good angels and there was fallen angels bad angels um, criminal um, and there was a battle that was happening in heaven with these two the good and the bad now what they were fighting over was the birth of Christ um, obviously, um, the ones that had a negative mindset um, uh, opposed his birth. Um, ones that had a positive mindset um, um, rejoiced his birth. Now, like I said, I saw that they had a suit on and they came through and then BAM they were able just to and these wings came out 
and these wings um, uh, supported uh, different maneuvers because, I mean, they weren't gliding. Uh, I mean, they were taking U-turns, they were veering far left, and they were veering far right, and, you know, as they were banging and knocking one another, um, they were, you know, there was a lot of tumbling, and I mean, there was, oh, easy hundreds, easy. So, these wings, and why they're depicted with wings, and why in ancient history and history period they're always drawn or carved or or somehow associated with having wings um this is the very reason so when we looked up as human beings um uh, and we saw them flying around without any ship um, and they had these wings um, unbeknownst to technology because even if there was technology, I doubt that the population um, uh, uh, would have shown any interest really. Um, it, it would have been oblivious. They would have been oblivious. And so when you do see this and don't recognize the fact that it is a technology, um, uh, you're going to draw it just the way that you see it. And the way that you see it are these people are flying around in heaven. Um, they've got some type of, our skies, some type of uniform on. And as they come into our atmosphere, bang, all of a sudden these wings open up. And there we go. So, to answer the question, why are they always depicted with wings? And how, where the wings come in, you now know. So, on this note, I really hope I gave you something to think about. I hope I gave you something to ponder over. And if not, I really hope that I surprised you with this little bit of information. So, until next video, I will bid you an adieu. And uh, we'll see you soon. Don't forget to like. And if you do like, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.